Greetings humans! In today's video, we will see the importance of visualizing data beyond just the summary stats. Let's dive in. Okay, let's say you have four groups of granular data, and each of the four groups X and Y values share the same respective summary mean values. It is incredibly hard for humans to read granular data tables, which is often why you try and summarize them like this. And other examples, like the summary stats for a website's analytics data, an online advertising campaign's performance, or your own bank statements. So let's plot these data points onto a scatter graph and see if anything stands out. Very quickly, you can see how varied and different the distribution of each group's X and Y values are. Something that would be incredibly hard in the tabular view is done in seconds when the data is visualized. This highlights the important role data visualization plays when humans analyze data. This was the main point Francis Anscombe was making when he created this data set demonstrate both the importance of graphing data before analyzing it and the effect of outliers. He described this exercise as being intended to counter the impression that numerical calculations are exact, but graphs are rough. And that we should also make both calculations and graphs. Both sorts of output should be studied. Each will contribute to understanding. More recently, Others have built upon this, such as Alberto Cairo, who created the familiar-sounding Datasaurus Dozen dataset. I put the data into Tableau, and we can see it draws very distinct shapes when graphed, but they all share near-identical summary stats. He even draws a Datasaurus with the data, and my vanity will let me infer the source of his inspiration for that name. So the next time you encounter summary stats, remember Anscombe's quartet and to graph the granular data too. You never know what might be lurking below. And thanks for watching. If you found this video entertaining or helpful, please give it a like, comment or subscribe. And if you want to check out some more videos, check out this playlist here. Until the next time.